So hi guys, Lou Beltran here, the IT veteran, and in today's video, we're going to be discussing about wireless network design and planning. So wireless design, network, and uh, planning uh, is very important when you're um, trying to build a Wi-Fi network because um, there's so many things that can uh, attribute to uh, a failed network design um, in terms of the environment can also take uh, uh, can also come into play um, how you design uh, the network is very important so 90% um, of all Wi-Fi problems out there that I have encountered in real life from coming from my clients and previous clients are caused by having a bad design from the start okay? either they don't really know what they were doing or they just uh, installed as many access points as they uh, they can because of very poor uh, signal. So what they tend to do there is, um, if I have a Wi-Fi signal, a very weak Wi-Fi signal at uh, a one point in my property or at my home or at the office, um, I just need to put another access point there and uh, it will become much more better. Okay. Um, sometimes it will work, but most of the time it's wrong. Okay, it's it's a bad way to design a wireless network. So what I'm going to be teaching you today is how to design a very good Wi-Fi network. So providing great Wi-Fi means having the right plan from the start, and uh, the right plan from the start means you know you need to have a a, a, a good know-how on how uh, a Wi-Fi system or a Wi-Fi network usually works. Now, I'll be leaving some of the theoretical stuff out, um, out of this video because I'll be creating a separate videos for those, but we'll, we'll touch base on a little bit of them, okay, in this uh, video. So, the most essential step in any network wireless design is you need to plan it first. Okay. So successfully deploying a wireless network solution is more than just installing a bunch of access points and hoping that they work. So um, the parts of a wireless uh, network design for a, a business or basically coming from your house, okay, if you want to do it in your house, is five things. There are five things that you need to do in order for you to build a very good wireless network design. So what's the first one? It's site surveys. Number two is an RF plan. Number three, a wireless capacity plan. And number four, proper hardware check. And five, an SD-WAN solution. Now, after you have submitted all of this, then that will become your project scope. Or you can now work on uh, building your wireless network. So let's tackle first wireless site surveys. So what is a wireless site survey? A wireless site survey is basically you tour around their property and try to identify um, uh, their structural design for um, one, uh, the current deployment of their wireless access point, um, the materials they did, uh, they used for building the, uh, the property or uh, the offices itself. And as you can see here in the screen, this is uh, one of my previous clients, um, we actually had uh, 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 a Wi-Fi solution installed here. And as you can see, I'm still using Ubiquiti. Right? Um, we also did uh, the structured cabling. That's why um, uh, uh, we were able to really optimize uh, the coverage for their wireless access points. And um, they were very happy about the result um all of their clients and all of their um customers are getting consistent wi-fi uh, performance on their property now it's the same also in the hotel that we are doing right now as a case study um we were involved pretty early on the build out of the hotel which was a, one of the nicest parts when building a wireless network because you can actually um really plan things out carefully when uh, they are building uh, uh, the IT infrastructure, you can actually um, provision the, the, the proper structured cabling equipment and the proper uh, 
specifications for the cables and, and etc. Right? The layout, cable trays, and, 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 and all of those uh, things. So what resulted here was um, um, it's another good wireless design on, on our end. <laughs> okay. So um, as you can see here in the pictures, um, uh, this was uh, when uh, the hotel is nearing completion. But this was before the hotel was actually, um, uh, it, when, when it was still being built. Okay. As you can see, we, we have already our um, Cat6 cables uh, dangling at the, the ceiling. We laid out the PVC pipings for uh, where the, our Cat6 cables will be um, passing through. We also chipped out, out um, the pathways for the electrical and separating it to our separating it from our structured cabling because it, it electrical cables are um, uh, a very good source of attenuation for uh, and a very good source of uh, network disruption actually okay, for uh, in terms of Wi-Fi performance. Thank <music> you.